Okay, in this video we're going to describe the wiring connections uh, for our M series actuator, 120 volts AC. Uh, this is a simple unit that has the 120 volt motor, a brake, a power start capacitor, and then we also have our two limit switches, the close on the bottom and the open on the top. This is a two-wire system. You have 120 volts. Your neutral line runs into pin one. And then your hot line is split to go to pins two and three through either a single-fold double-throw contact on a relay or some type of a control switch that is also single-fold double-throw. Uh, the actuator is shipped and is shown here in the open position and the green cam which is the open actually has allowed the switch to open up and cut the power to the motor. When I flip the switch to run to the closed position we're going to apply power to pin 3 and the actuator will rotate the shaft This will rotate until the bottom cam rotates to open the switch. The actuator is now in the closed position. The bottom switch has been opened, which cuts the power to the motor. And if this actuator is not exactly in the position that it needs to be. The set screw inside the yellow cam can be loosened and the cam rotated either left or right to either open or close the actuator a little bit further. The same goes for moving into the other position back to open. We are now applying power to pins 1 and 2 through the switch. And as the cam rotates on the green or second switch, it opens the switch which cuts the power to the motor. And again, if the positioning is not exactly right, the set screw on that cam can be loosened and the cam rotated to adjust for the uh, trip of the switch to allow either a little bit more or less on the open. The power is constantly applied to either pins 1 and 2 or pins 1 and 3. Uh, the only thing that cuts the power is the switch that is tripped to cut the power to the motor. The motor start capacitor is always needed uh, to give the power that the motor needs to, to get started. And in this case here, the brake that is wired into uh, the motor start capacitor is energized here in this position to hold the motor in position when it gets to the stopping point.